Also happening today, Governor Hutchinson holding a press conference this morning regarding hate crime laws in Arkansas. Arkansas Today's Jay Burr was at that meeting. He joins us now with more. Jay. Yeah, Mallory, Arkansas, one of only three states in the country to not have some sort of hate crime legislation on the books. And today, lawmakers gathered at the state capitol to try to make sure they weren't going to be the last state to do so. Now, Governor Hutchinson, along with many, or, uh, Attorney General Leslie Rutledge and sponsors of the bill, both Republican and Democrat, gathered in the Capitol Rotunda to introduce a draft bill for hate crime laws. Now, the bill looks to create sentencing enhancements for crimes committed due to a person's race, religion, ethnicity, national origin, ancestry, sexual orientation, homelessness, gender identity, sex, disability, or service in the armed forces. Now, if a person is found guilty, it could carry an additional 20% of any punishment levied. So 20% more prison time, 20% more fines, and any additional terms of probation. Now, leaders all echoed a similar message that Arkansas needs this now to protect all Arkansans from hate crimes. We need to say clearly that Arkansas will not tolerate violence against anyone because of their race, their religion, or because of who they are. Also in the bill, it can be a Class C felony for bringing a frivolous, groundless, or malicious prosecution for a hate crime. And also, the state would begin collecting this type of data. And every year on December 1st, the Attorney General will publish a report on those hate crime statistics. And again, I want to just make sure that we're all clear here that this is only a draft bill. It will have to go through the legislative process come the next general session in order for that to become law. But many lawmakers do say they expect a bit of a a spirited debate when it comes to this topic. Live from the state capitol, Jay Burt for Arkansas Today.